what's up everyone I just thought I'd give a real quick update on our tortoise table um, and the things that we have going on with it so this is for my wife's sulcata tur uh, tortoise she's only maybe three months old now I think I could be wrong on that but anyways she's just a tiny little little baby um, so I built this stand um, to keep it on it's here in the my in the office next to my wife's very busy desk <laughs> so I'll try and not show all of her stuff but anyways um, so I've got the stand and then I bought this table off of Amazon uh, I like this this not, not the table I'm sorry I built the stand I built the enclosure uh, I bought the enclosure off of Amazon so I'll just give you a real quick tour of it. Um, so we've got the the cool side which is over here and then we've just got one log one little hide over here she really doesn't go in this side very often um, she did sleep in it one day but that was really it um, here I don't want to open it up too much because she's actually in her little dish eating but <laughs> um, anyways I'll lift it up here we're gonna lose some humidity and some heat doing this but um, so right now the humidity is only showing 30 percent but it fluctuates throughout the day it gets as high as about 45 percent in here without me misting it all right so obviously we have to mist it to keep the humidity levels higher as well but um and then we've got this little fountain that's in here too but uh, so also we've got our um <clears throat> wise camera that way we can keep an eye on her when she's out you know when we're not home, make sure she doesn't flip over or whatever. But um, her little uh, block there to chew on, which she hasn't yet. So um, there's her mix. I just gave her some, a little bit of greens, but that's uh, her pellets. Um, I'll, I'll show the, they're the natural grassland tortoise food pellets that you uh, put in, add water to them, and then they do that. So it's a lot easier than shredding grass up. Uh, then she's got her little water dish over there, and she's got her favorite hide that she goes up underneath of right there. Um, this is an Arcadia um, Pro T5 UVB kit that we bought. So that's the way that I've mounted it to the grate up here. I basically, I just I used the clips that they gave us, and then I just used bread ties, okay? So I just stripped uh, the bread ties and put them on there and then I've got plexiglass on the top to help with the heat um, and the uh, um, <clears throat> humidity a little bit and then of course her heat lamp there so that's really that's really it um, and as you can see uh, the humidity already went up 1% so it'll, it'll climb up um, the lights haven't been on for too long today so it'll 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 creep up it'll it'll creep into the 90s for the like mid 90s for the temperature and humidity will get up I said you know like I said to about 45 percent um, just on its own so um, but yeah that's uh that's Clementine the tortoise there you go. <laughs> And we've tried a couple of different pellets for her food, and I will tell you that this is the one that she eats the most, all right? She actually does prefer this brand. I don't know why, but there you go. That's what she eats. So I'm surprised that she's not, she usually like hunkers down into her shell if I open the lid or whatever, but she's not doing it today. So um, yeah, check out the, the little fountain she'll climb up on the fountain and drink some water looks like I need to add some water to it because usually there's some down in the little little bin there but anyways that's um yeah that's my wife's tortoise uh, as far as how long I think I can keep her in this tank um, I, I think at least until she's a year old depends upon how she grows but I've, I've seen some some videos that people have done of theirs and yeah, I'm pretty sure I might have to, I, I think we'll be good till she's about a year old, but we'll see. I'm not sure. Uh, so hope, hope you guys like the update. Um, 
Yeah, so uh, some other things. Um, I always keep a little water jug down here, but um, this is the temperature gun that I use to just verify her temps. And then um, I do, this is the orchid grass um, hay that we bought. And then there's some little natural flowers that we give her occasionally. And this is actually from my Euromastics, but there's some flower food topper. <laughs> All right, that's it. Thanks for watching. When life keeps falling and wonder where he is in all this mess, he's right there to guide you, unseen or not.